what's going on guys? Your boy X here. Today we're doing that Seven Deadly Sins Season 4 Episode 4 a Live Reaction. Uh, last we left off, uh, we got kind of like a big... What's the word I want to say? We got like a big reveal, I guess, with Zeldris. The fact that he actually was in love, you know? Was in love with a vampire. Um, apparently... Um, you know, he thought the vampires all died, but apparently Meliodas saved her, so she's still alive, but she's, like, sealed or whatever. Um, and, yeah, he basically told her that, you know, once they get all the commandments, I'll bring it back for you, blah, blah, blah. And, of course, Escanora hit that fool with the mean finger attack, finger banged him. So, you know, <laughs> that's where we are now. Um, but let's go and get started. Uh, remember though, guys, for more Seven Deadly Sins live reaction slash reviews, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below for me to the channel. Still trying to get to that 30k. I believe we're like 500-ish away. <laughs> so if you're new here, you're coming often. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. Right. About to begin this, guys. In five, four, three, two, one. Let's get it. <laughs> oh wow! Straight off the bat, he hit him with that last move. Okay, what kind of attack name? All right, the victims of the Holy War. Let's see what we're doing now. Okay, Zelda's just still living. Damn, but he, he ain't looking too good. Damn, <laughs> Ludacil was quick with it. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. What the hell? He's got a dark light saying? What the hell is this shit? Have you finished saying goodbye? Oh, okay, they at least have... Oh, psh, never mind, it's useless. <laughs> I don't have time for that! Wow. Okay, I mean... Tremble at my grace. I mean... This is, this is practically like a lightsaber duel right here, like... <laughs> da -da, da -da, da -da. Whoa! Hey! <laughs> Guilt on to get your girl, whoa! <laughs> where was she at on the, uh... That's probably, yeah, matter of fact, yeah. Where was, where, where were, uh... Where, where was she at on the, um... Are you unharmed? I was on my wife who is. I mean, I know right now Ludus is in her body, but, you know, still. <laughs> they just do the same thing. Damn, I mean, his beam is bigger, but I mean, does that matter? <laughs> wow. Enchant Infinity. Oh damn, she uh, sh she went through his ass. Huh? Bigger up, Escanor. Still. <laughs> Get 
got his ass down. Except for the Demon King. Hmm. You have to create it? What? She is not showing any mirror. What is happening right now? <laughs> okay, here we go with some Merlin craziness, real quick. Let's see here. I definitely wouldn't want her to hurt my enemy. Yo, Merlin, dog. She just <laughs> very smart. That's why. That's why you were in S tier. I feel like I would rather want to get hit by wind than electricity. Like he just looks like he's in a goddamn like a vortex, like in a a cool breeze that's going over him. He's like, he looks like he's in pain. The other one just looks like he's like, oh man, it's wind. Oh. I don't understand it either. Okay, okay. It's not even a fair fight. So I'm trying to figure out. See if she did this shit when she was teleporting backwards. He's got a point. Okay, guy. Okay. Come on, Merlin. Can she heal this man? Like, what's going on here? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Isn't that what he... Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't that the same thing they did to Arthur when they made him kill him or something? I just have a feeling, dog. She, she's like, okay, you can get the hell out of my head. <laughs> Got your ass molly walked by a little girl. Oh, wow. This is her face, dog. She just looks so evil. 
Yeah, I, I, I was wondering, like, if she, like, felt, because she, I mean, in the moment, yeah, she was angry as shit, but she don't seem, he's like, hey, hey. The hell is this? Damn, is that just still on his dad? Damn. Oh, no. It's a wrap. <laughs> the long holy war. It wasn't that long, I mean. <laughs> now at least if we're not combining with the old one. Uh-oh, wait, it's his dad, huh? <laughs> I mean, if he's as big as he is in the opening, how can you miss this guy? Like, where the hell is he? My son doesn't need emotions. Damn, I mean, is that his hand or is it his foot? What? what? This man's in the clouds the whole time. Like, look at this man. He's looking clean. I ain't gonna lie to him. <laughs> Ball's like, God damn, he's big, man. <laughs> he's getting power by consuming the pills. Hmm. It's been changing. What? what? I don't remember anything about Esther Rosa. He can use darkness in his fear of flight. He couldn't even kill an instant. <laughs> Seems like he fooled everyone. We know that's so including me. What's he talking about? Who is he talking about? Well, wait. If we're talking about memories here, then it would have to be. It would have to be Golden. That's like the only person. Unless he's talking about somebody else. All my magic and life force. Alternate memories of everyone who knows a certain man, including the guys. Oh, wow. Okay. That's an OPS ability. I mean, you lose your life, but damn.
they're returning. I wonder, so what's making them remember just now? There's a small possibility. Okay, I guess it wasn't permanent. It'll be very strong and pregnant. <laughs> it's still... Damn, everybody over here. I can't remember Ma's face or Mayo's. I mean, if I'm going by the opening. <laughs> if I'm going by the opening, the only thing that could be is. Like. Well, because Ludacil said when she thinks of. Well, when he thinks of Ma, the only see that's right. So, I mean, maybe they're like the same. Because, I mean, if I'm going by the opening, it shows like Esther Rosa with Angel Wings. That's the only I can think of. There's no, there's no way. Yeah, there's no commandment with that name. My brother? Da, da, da. Gelda? Who the fuck is that? Hey, wait, he just said Zeldris is his only brother. Wait, what? What happened in here? Maybe I am right, but... Where did the dog, where did the dog come from? <laughs> what? Basta Rosa? <laughs> That damn oh had the opening not I'm gonna save it for the review portion. But this is crazy. This is an OP ass ability. The memories of him as a demon and the memories of him as a member of the clan of God. <laughs> wow! Man, that's got to suck for him because he's going to have like double memories, huh? The goat? Yo, hold up, wait, what's that? Oh shit, this nigga got his wings back! Oh. The Astros Recommend Men never existed. Aw, oh, damn.
everyone believed that, but he really is. Wow, that's crazy. It can't be! This fool's got a tear. One of the four archangels of my. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at this fool. Alright, what we're learning now? Episode preview theater. What? Well, Ben Spell has been broken. Everyone's king. <laughs> it's got the damn hand like the others. I have a headache. <laughs> it hurts! Oh, wow! A sorrowful blow. Hmm. Alright, so first off, man, I gotta just go ahead and knock this out the way. I feel like, had they not put, it's basically like they just put the damn spoiler in the damn opening, you know. Uh, I was curious, like, why they had Ezra looking like an angel, and sure enough, boom, he's Maul. Whoa! <laughs> Right? Like, had they not put that in the opening, I think, honestly, this would have been, like, a crazy-ass reveal. Like, I did not see this shit coming, you know? Um, what was I about to say? Like, I mean, first of all, Gother, this man, I mean, I'm talking about wheelchair Gother. I feel like I gotta do, like, an example. Wheelchair Gother, this man, that was, like, an OPS ability. Granted, he had to, like, sacrifice his life to use it. But damn, to change the memories of everybody that knows somebody, plus even the gods? Like, come on, that's an that's a OP-ass ability. Um, but I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let me go back to um, towards the beginning where we had like the aftermath of the Zeldra's fight. Uh, you know, Esther Rose, he turned back into his human form because I guess, you know, it's no longer daytime, right? Um... So, really, it was just the other two demons that were left, because Zelda Zil just got, like, knocked out in a sense. Um, but, thanks to Merlin, Merlin just... <laughs> Merlin? Like, she just has, like, old penis to her name. It might as well be her middle name. Merlin, OP, whatever her last name is. Like, the fact that she basically, like, her first move that she used on him... It was basically to, I'm gonna sum this up because I'm not trying to explain exactly what she said, but like, basically the first move she ever used on them at the beginning of the fight, it was basically to get a sense of like what their weakness is or like what, like closest that she can get. Like, so basically that first move she used, I think she said it had four elements to it, so she was trying to see like which of the four elements were they weakest to the most. As far as... The big one, the one with the cane, his was like lightning. He was weak to lightning, whereas the other one, he was weak to wind. So, basically, uh, I forgot what the move is called. Like, double, I was going to say double whammy. <laughs> but basically, they're going to keep getting hit by that same element over and over and over. It's like a constant thing. So, one guy, he, get, he keeps getting electric. And the other one, he just keeps getting a cool breeze of wind. Which, like I said, that doesn't really seem too threatening. Like, he's like, oh! Oh, oh, it's not like he's getting cut up or nothing, you know, but yeah. So, but the other one, which kind of funny that I say that about the wind, because he, like, he had time to do an, a move on uh, Merlin. He ends up doing the same move um, that was done on Arthur. To where you can, you know, control the person and, like, uh, compel him to do whatever. Like, how they had Arthur stab himself, right? Um, so, he goes into Merlin's mind. He's like, oh, this is your true self. Which is, like, the little girl of Merlin or whatever. He starts talking that mad shit. And then Merlin, she's like, ha, okay. And, like, punches her in the face. Like, he, and it just, like, sits on him and shit. And then she's like, oh, yeah, I'm about to get back at you for what you did to Arthur. Yeah, I'm like, oh, shit. But it was short-lived. Like, for, and then also, too, Zeldra's. He tried to actually help them, which, you know, I could applaud because he was already jacked up from uh, uh, Escanor. Like, I was like, damn. But he tried to help, but uh, Ludacil ended up doing, like, a final blow to Zelda. Don't think he's dead, though, but hit him to knock him out. And then, you know, Ludacil, <laughs> finally, the war is over. <laughs> we, um, and I think this is, I don't know if this is what caused all this to start happening, but, you know, basically it was like, this is revenge from all. And then... When he said that, he was just like, what the, uh, what I think of Maul, all I can see is Esther's face. Uh! And then, you know, it starts showing everybody, like, it goes back to King and them fighting him. 
Um, but all of a sudden, the archangels are like, Ugh, my head, it hurts! Like, everybody's like over here, like, remembering Esther Rosa even goes to hell. And we do get to finally see the, uh, the Demon King. And, you know, a little bit with him, uh, apparently from what, um, I'm about to say, Hawk, what was his name? Rush or whatever. Uh, apparently from him, apparently he has been evolving in hell. You know, uh, I don't know if that's why he's so big or what, but he's been evolving in hell from what he said. So, um, you know, he's like, um, oh, I can see you where you can start to remember too, huh? Tell me something about Esterosa. And then, um, you know, um, <laughs> Meliodas is like, um, you know, he's my, he's my younger brother, uh, you know, uh, he very, like, he, he couldn't hurt a fly, uh, you gave him a commandment because of that, you get it, and like, the whatever, and then he's like, oh, now I see, and then, like, you know, goes back to, like, the, the, the earth or whatever, and then, you know, everybody's like, uh, 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 and then even as the Rosa, he starts to, like, think to, and then it goes to Elizabeth, and that's where we really get like the meat and potatoes of what's going on. Um, because like basically she's like giving us the flashbacks of what like really like it's like basically what every like well I guess you could say what he remembers, then it jumps to like what really happened or whatever. And so we do find out and I, I, I love how it was like the blackness was around him and it like starts to crack like you know like a cocoon or something. He breaks out of it and he has his angel wings and stuff. Uh, but yeah, he goes into his real form, which is a mouth, which is crazy. So I'm guessing. Well, I'm gonna get into that in a little bit. But yeah, so he breaks out of it and he's like, <laughs> you know, um, he still has a little black stuff on his face. Um, so I'm very curious, and this is where we're about to get, because that was pretty much the episode. But I'm very curious now, now that we know that he is Maul, you know, first of all, obviously I'm guessing he doesn't have his grace because that's what uh, Escanor has, right? So, doesn't have his grace, however, I'm curious if he still has his commandment, and it's very strange, because I thought commandments could only be given to demons, you know, or maybe that's not the case, who knows, uh, but he's an angel, so he has a commandment, so it's like, oh, and, uh, you know, and, and, and we already know he's been starting going crazy because he starts getting the commandments. But maybe that's why. Maybe because he's an angel, he's starting to go crazy as shit because um, I feel like... Am I... If, doesn't... Yeah, Meliodas has a couple commands, but he hasn't been going crazy. If I'm, if I'm remembering correctly, right? Unless I'm... No, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he has like two of them, if I'm not mistaken. So, like, yeah, he's not going crazy. It's only Escanor that's going crazy. So maybe that's why, like, since he's an angel and maybe he's not supposed to have the commandments or something like that. So maybe that's why he's starting to go crazy. He's a bam! You know, like that. So that's the only thing I can think of. But I'm curious if he's gonna get his um, his grace back from um, um, uh, Escanor. That, that, this, is, this is very interesting. Like I said, I am kind of upset that they spoiled that in the opening. Cause like I said, I don't think I would have saw that shit coming at all. Like I'm like, oh shit. Um, you know. So uh, I will say on that standpoint, this was a great twist. I will say that just because of the opening. It still was a great twist. I'm pretty sure, like, the people that read the manga, I'm pretty sure they're like, oh, shit! Like, like let, if you if y'all read the manga, let me know how y'all's reaction was to this. Because, like I said, the opening definitely messed that up for us anime watchers, I feel like. But I'm sure, like, in the moment when it happened for y'all's manga readers, y'all was like, oh, shit! So, y'all let me know in the comment section. But that's all, guys. Remember, for more uh, 7 Deadly Sins live reactions slash reviews, make sure I hit the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. I'm still trying to get to that 30k, so help your boy out. Also, hit the bell to get notified when I drop my videos. Also, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, my Facebook game page, and the Discord. All of them in the description box below. If you like the video, guys, like the video, comment, let me know what your favorite part of the episode was. And as always, guys, it's been your boy X, and I'm out. Deuces.